Oh yo, what's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. So I've seen a lot of conversation going around about who has the better fans. Is it the American fans? Is it the European fans? So I thought we would uh, do a reaction video comparing the two groups. Now specifically, we are referring to American football. So the fans taking place in college football or NFL and, you know, traditional worldwide football referred to you guys as soccer. Um, and you know, I think both crowds can get very, very rowdy indeed. So this should be a fun video to react to. So without any further delay, let's get into it. So American fans, let's see what you guys have got going for us. Oh man, insane, absolutely insane. So this is Michigan. So it must be so this is college football that is crazy to me is this college football guys please let me know but that is insane everyone wearing yellow everyone in sync seven nations army unbelievable this is the university of south carolina just madness absolute madness Man, I wish I was part of a crowd like this. You know, in South Africa, we our, our rugby crowds definitely do not get as rowdy as this. Is it true that the college football stadiums fill up more than the actual NFL games? This is ridiculous. You can't find a blank space in sight crazy spectacle uh snowball fight in the crowd I, I i'm guessing we don't see this too often I, I don't know if this is truly representative of an american crowd but you guys let me know okay so this is definitely an nfl game kansas city the vibe must be so great i wonder if this is in one of the the uh, Super Bowl winning seasons. The crowd are just into it. Totally in sync. Well, almost in sync. <laughs> Not quite in sync, but almost. That's just insane, though. Okay, we're going to check out some European fans. So this is the football that I know. Okay, this is Stuttgart in Germany. The German football games in the Bundesliga can get crazy, especially Borussia Dortmund. I love the Borussia Dortmund fans. So it's just a wave of yellow. I can't even see what's going on. All I know is it's loud. <laughs> Ooh, okay, we're seeing some. I don't know what do you what do you call those things? Uh, uh, you know, you know what they are. Uh, flashes. Those aren't actually legal. Then you're not actually al allowed to bring them in. But some people bring them in illegally. Unfortunately, they can be dangerous. But it just shows the raucous atmosphere that the European fans bring for football. Football is life in Europe. Football is life all over the world. It's the biggest sport in the world by a distance. This is Saint Etienne in France. This must be in Ukraine maybe? Also, passionate football fans the football stadiums as far as capacity is concerned i've seen is slightly smaller than some of your college and nfl football games sometimes you guys in america have hundreds of thousands hundred thousand people in a lot of those stadiums whereas in the european stadiums they, they, they range between 40 and 80 thousand this is in uh, amsterdam ajax in the Netherlands is one of the most iconic European football clubs. 
of all time. Home of Johan Cruyff. One of the late great footballers. But you can just see the passion oozing from these fans. It's, I'm telling you guys, I've been to so many games in the past and it is a huge atmosphere. This is in Sweden. You'll notice that football is almost a religion in most European countries. It's just so massive there. And we ain't even talking about South America, guys. In South America, it's, it's just as big, if not bigger. This is clearly after a game. That was clearly after a game, hence why you can see there's a few empty seats. A lot of times at the end of a football game, you know, the players will go interact with the crowd to say thank you for coming out to support them. It's always a nice moment between players and fans. But yeah, that was interesting. I mean, I, I'm, mes I, I'm truly mesmerized by the American uh, fans and the American crowds. I think mostly because I'm just not used to watching too many, you know, American football games or NFL games, but I'm starting to get really into it. I've been keeping up to date with the NFL from beginning uh, of the season all the way up till now. It's going to be interesting. I believe that the 49ers are going to win the Super Bowl. I think they're going to go all the way based on what I've seen. And I think Brock Purdy is going to get the MVP. But let me know if you think I'm incorrect. Let me know your opinions. Firstly, which fan bases are more crazy? Is it the American fans or is it the European fans? Tell me below. And secondly, tell me who do you think is going to win the Super Bowl this season? I'd love to see your opinions below. But yeah, folks, that is all that I have for you today. If you did enjoy this video, please remember to like and subscribe. But again, until next time, I hope you have a good one. Cheers.